Hello! I'm here. This game is loud. Am I actually broadcasting? Let's find out. It's true. I am actually broadcasting. Now I'm going to tweet about it. Since I'm on PlayStation and don't have um, loading overlay stuff. <laughs> Let's go to settings. Uh, I think I'll leave this here. Audio. So we'll see if I can make this work in a way that people can see me. All right, there's a, there's a person. Settings, radical HUD, jump prompt, yes, yes, English. Well, well, we'll find out about that. Audio controls, no invert, no rebind necessary, motion blur, we'll see about that. Um, if you are watching, I know that the cat has, like gets injured and has a limp for a little while, but the cat gets better. And sometimes the cat fights monsters and dies, but it's not gory. And if you want assurances that the cat does not like die at the end of the game, I have been assured the cat does not die at the end of the game. Um, so if you are very sensitive to animals getting injured, this Maybe something to be uh, a little bit cautious about. I hope that it will not be too upsetting for me, and I hope it will not be too upsetting for you. But the cat is very cute. I'm just going to redo my hair tie while waiting to see if anyone else is going to show up right away. My computer is currently in a short queue to be accessed by remote data forensic specialists, I guess, that are going to try and access my... Um, so it's the SSD on my main desktop, which is unfortunately where all of my writing documents live. Um, and I don't back everything up as often as I should. I thought that I had backed up a specific novel, uh, a novel draft, way more re recently than I actually had. So I would be very bummed out if um, that data is all a loss and I'm not able to retrieve that. Because it would be 18,000 words lost on a novel draft, which really suck. Um, I would lose some other stuff, which would also suck, but not as intensely as the novel. Just... So, keep your fingers crossed. If you have a good relationship with technological gods, I would appreciate your propitiations on my behalf. Ooh, look at this, it's pretty. So like a reddish moon. And there's a 
some technological something, some pipes. There is cat. Several cats. Also, I beg your indulgence. I am having very bad allergies. So, I'm guessing I am this cat. Hello? Yes, I am this cat. His cat. Trump, 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 trump. Hello, other cat. Yes! What a good cat. Poke, poke, poke. Look at that kitty. And then the other cat sits back down. Okay. Hello, other, other cat. third other other cat. It's very stormy out. Okay. Well, I guess I can go down on that pipe. Ah, so curl up and sleep. All cats sleep. And that's the game. We did it. Hello, the kids are asleep. Uh, I gave my cat uh, preface earlier. So my understanding is that the cat has a limp in the early game, but gets better. And then uh, I think everything else you've heard when we were chatting on uh, Discord. Butterfly. Now this is just a reading rainbow episode. The cat's going to walk around and there's going to be books. Wouldn't that be fun? Well, it doesn't look like it's raining now, right? Not so much. Where's the fourth cat? Okay, well I'm glad you have prepared for cat things. inside the wall. Cat's just tromping around, doing cat things. So we'll have a platforming tutorial here, or is this all going to be cutscene? Yep, happy lunching. I will be here watching the very pretty game be a pretty game. Okay. Yeah, where is Black Cat? Oh, there you are. Hello. Good. Hey, hi, Trefity Mats. Happy Friday to you. I don't think the cat can climb up that. Yes? Are you telling me that we need to go the other way? Maybe. I want to check. Nope, can I go up this? Can I go up this? I can. Okay, and I go down this, and then I can jump up, jump around. Okay, nothing there. Can jump up here. Hi. Right. Are you something? No, you're a little bump of something. Hey, what's up? You want to go this way? Yes. Press circle to meow. So would post-apocalypse cats still meow the same way if meowing is has been observed as a 
uh, a thing that cats do when humans are around as a way of like getting humans to like them. I don't know. Scratching post. Ah. Yes, scratching mini game. I'm gonna guess there's a point at which you have to do a scratching mini game or a scratching subsystem on something. Very pretty. there. That's a very big down. Where'd the other cats go? Probably over there. Whoop. Yep, hello other cats. Drink some water. Oh, okay, maybe. I have not uh, lived with cats because I'm allergic. I have been in places where people have cats a fair amount, but not uh, kind of the whole the whole time when there's kittens or whatever. Okay, we trump. Trump, 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 trump. Yes, schnorfel. guessing that there's not actually much in the way with secrets here in terms of this opening section. Allergic to cats, dogs, horses, guinea pigs. Oh, that is sadness. Though so I saw um, one of our neighbors uh, just had a, like their dogs just had a litter of puppies who are um, Bichon, Bichon Freeze and Poodle, Bichon Poo or Pouchon, um, and those are supposed to be hypoallergenic. So I don't know if there are if there are dog breeds or cat breeds that would be more would be less allergy inducing. But it's hard to know, and then if you get the cat, you know, you get the animal and you really like them, but then you're allergic, that can be really heartbreaking. What if I go this way? What's over here? Just more plants? I can sneak under that, right? Yes, look at that. Well, that's just a door. So I sneak under that. Now I return to my cat. My cat uh, siblings. Probably siblings. So if there's cats, there's presumably other animals around, but then there's a question of what they're eating, what the other animals are eating. There's some rocks. You know, some animals are eating these plants, right? There's bugs. And now we sneak under here. Loading screen, possibly. Okay, 
and there's beams. Lo, look at all these convenient clusters of things to jump on. Video games. Hold L2 to observe. that last cat is going to fall. Okay, this is... We may be getting cat injury here. Very sad cat sound. Ooh! is very far away from other cats. So, yeah, cat limb. Some electronics on over there. Oh no! Cat is too tired. Something is turning on, like a gate is opening, and there's something in that bag. Oh no! So those are bad things. Those are the zerks, I think is the word that they use. Seems to be walking around better now. Okay, so I guess now I'm supposed to go over there. That's big trash pile. I definitely am not getting back up that. thing that was left open, and here's where the Zerks came, and it looks like there's some, not anything else to do. So now this is closed, and I cannot go back up, up out there, because it's a video game and we have to move forward. And I can jump up here, I can look around, so this is all inside. Dead city, but how, how dead is it? It's got something in it. There's a camera. Hello. I can't. Can I jump on the camera? No. So all the writing is in. I don't know that that. It sort of looks like Korean, but I don't think that it is. Now might be an ang a language descended from Korean. 
if this is like post 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 apocalypse. Uh oh. Robot is probably not roboting anymore. I think that Android is not a is not alive. So level design would tell me that I'm supposed to go this way where the sign is. I can't get up anymore. Something only and no no trombones or trumpets. Uh oh. Oh help. Ooh, sludge. I probably don't want to get in the sludge. That would be my guess. if I can get to that pipe, right? Then I can tromp around. No. Uh, I can jump up here. Oh, but there's spikies. I can't jump up on that. through the wires here. Hello? You look like you might have somebody around. Follow me. I have a tiny bucket. to get water in my tiny bucket. to fill the pan with water, or the little bucket with water. Uh-oh. I did kick that bucket, yes. Whoop, time to go. Is this just cat of, like, knock things over? Yes! Knock things over. Truly. The cat game everyone's been waiting for. Be a cat. Knock things over. I wonder if I get an achievement if I knock over every single thing I can. jump. I feel like I should be able to do that jump. Let's 
not down from here. Uh, well, I can jump on here. That's a down, but I don't know that I'm supposed to jump on that. There's a camera over there. Hello, camera. Let's see. Is there like a window I'm missing? Everything is covered up in spikes. Ooh, look at that. I've been rewarded for my crimes. Oh, look, and the, the paint makes paw prints. Kids. I'm sorry, I can't. I cannot follow your directions. I have to make biscuits. The feedback on the PlayStation 5 control is very good when you're doing that. Okay, but what if I just want to MCAT? All right, some instructions. I'm gonna jump up here and knock things over. Don't mind me. Be cat, do crime. Just destroy everything. Absolutely destroy everything. Get some water. I don't think there's like a survival meter it's like, oh, you didn't drink enough water the last time you stopped at a water spot. Okay, well, I can go out here. Signs. And a bucket! And I can't do anything with that, but I can. Looks like I can jump in the bucket. before? No, I don't think so. Hello, Android? So that looks like the uh, the Valve logo, right? Two to run. Oh dear.
Running in circles. Alright, I think I am temporarily safe. Secrets. So we're now far enough into the game where there might be secrets. over a platform. Hey look, I can go there. Cat destructiveness. Productive. Hello computer. I think the soundtrack of this game might be uh, pretty good for like mood mood writing. Uh, sound. Alright, so you're leaking also. This is like a laundromat. Can I roll around and hit inside here? Look at this! My cat! Oh, do I need to roll this over so that I can jump up on there? That was fun. Hey, look, I meowed and it made the lights go. I mean, fair, I did have to run away from little blobby monsters. Um, I guess I'm going this way now. of knocking things off of ledges. Agitated Mio. Mio is very uh, lifelike and disconcerting. Cat chaos.
go along this? No, but I can jump on this. track of where I'm supposed to be going. Oh, maybe it's just up here. Oh, looks like I'm supposed to be going up here. Why is it crashing? Sneak. So I pulled the battery out, and now the fan is not going. And I'm going to keep the battery, because I might need it. The flat. Oh, I don't know I can keep the battery. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm cat. Enter the door, turn on, find the body. Okay, the cat typing is very good. That door is closed now, so what do you want me to do? Camera. Ah, here we are. Hello. Oh, okay. Well, that's... That's the thing I can take. Can you let me back in now? Or is that for you? Please go here. game am I supposed to find the four batteries? Oh, that's a lever. Okay, well that's two. Let's see, where else are there battery things? What do you see, folks? I see one up there. How am I going to get that? We have to go up and along this way. So I can go up here.
cameras are nodding at me, which is, I suppose, good. There's a cat. So it looks like a Maneki Neko. Can the chair move? That's like a hard drive. So am I supposed to get up to that? Right, let's try up here again. Now that's just another hard drive. There's one down here. And can I get to the roof pipes? Oh, do I climb up on you when you're over here? Yes, I think I do. Okay. Secret tunnel. And now robot happy? That looks like a a body. Is there a, is there a person in here? Hello? What? That's not entirely what I meant to do. something? It's making a little robot buddy. With E.T. eyes. One, two, or B twelve. Hello, robot. I am cat, indeed. Yep. Thunk, thunk, thunk. Sorry, I don't speak robot. Oh, I speak that. It worked. I'm free. Thank you. I couldn't believe the cameras. Or a cat in the dead city. I'm... I can't remember my name. It seems my memory is corrupted. I've been trapped in the electronic network for so long. I know I worked for a scientist who lived here. For now, you can call me B12. That's what it says on my exterior. It's, it's dangerous in the dead city, but you seem like you know how to handle yourself. Let's get out of here. Follow me. Not alone. That key unlocks the door. I remember that much. Let me get that for you. 
Very good. Battery low already. Come over here. There you go. You're gonna have to put this on. Harness for cat? Yes. Ah, it's too heavy. I can't. Game over. Okay. I go. Oh, it is heavy. This backpack was designed for small quadrupeds like you. Is this uncomfortable for you? Yes. Yes, says Cat. Don't worry, you'll get used to it. I've digitized the key and stored it in the backpack. Keys. Memories. Easy. If you're ever curious about an object, you can show it to me. Or to others if we come across any. We will. We will come across others. Now let's get out of this flat. But I like this music. I suppose um, B12 needs battery, right? Select keys. Okay, that's the light. Excuse me, there's something over here. Are you loot? You are things I can knock off the of ledges. Alright. Use digicode. Okay. Maybe the code is in here. Yep, three four three seven four eight. B twelve needs energy. Ah yes, a bucket. Universal me method of uh, cat transport. Have hit by the retail shop, right? Wow, look at this place. That elevator in the distance. That's important, I think. I know we need to go up. So instead, I will go down. We. Oh, look at all the goop down there. That's not great. So I don't know if it's real back up. Cutscene. Wait, I remember the outside. Cats are liquid. That's... <laughs> feels like I've been there before. Is that where you came from? I promised someone I would go there. I promised who? This postcard. The barrel was painted from it. Let's take it. Oh wait. Gain new item. Why do I have these memories? How did they get here? Let's keep going. New memory recovered. No Zerks around right now. Right, 
cat can run. Translate. Safe zone. Well, yes, let's go to safe zone. I hope it's still safe. Look at all those something. The Zerks. Ah, no, don't get me. Extremely don't get me. Ah. Hello, I'm Pat. Uh, hi? I'm just a cat. Hello. Literally just a cat. The music did get more. Just a cat. Please don't try to hurt me. Okay, I'm guessing that's the other being speaking. They seem to have their own language. Guardian, you're no Zerk. We're not familiar with your kind. You are welcome in our village as long as you don't eat anyone. Please turn off the alarm. I think the Zerky robots, right? The orange murder balls. I like that they all have Game Boy faces. Hello, I am Cat. This fellow seems to know a lot about the area. Perhaps we should show him the postcard? Maybe he knows a way out of here. Uh, hello. I'm Cat. Uh, I guess you? Hello? You look lost. What do you need? Show item. Oh, a picture of outside. Ridiculous. This elevator isn't even operational. Everyone knows that it is impossible to leave this place. Well, except the outsiders. But they're all gone now, except Momo. You can try to talk to him if you want, but he gave up on trying to leave. It's for the best. He lives high up in that building with the orange neon sign. All right. Don't hesitate to call me anytime. I'm here to help. The Guardian told us to talk to Momo in the big building with the orange neon sign. He's the only lead we've got for getting out of here. Alright, and now we begin platforming. Here. 
Yes. Remembers. It looks like this poor guy also wanted to go to the upper level. Yes, I remember. Midtown is up there, away from all the garbage and sickness of the slums. Even in dire times, humans could not help but divide themselves by social class. Back then, a lot of people from the slums were prepared to do anything to move up there. Apparently, robots also copied this behavior. Well. Yep. Hierarchy. I'm guessing this stuff was all put down to defend against the Zerks, but then it's also making cat, uh, lock in cat. Guardian lives? Hat? Bed! Okay, Clementine's notebook. It's a strange notebook with a symbol on it. This one seems to belong to someone named Clementine. Everything seems going according to plan. Uh, how do I? Well, I want to make the text go up. Okay, everything is going according to plan. We managed to contact the upper level before the transceiver went down. They're in a place called Midtown, and apparently it's controlled by some kind of oppressive force. I talked to Momo earlier. His eyes. I know this look. He will not come with us. I don't know what this means, but I'll probably be useful later. We should go see this Momo person, the guardian took who the guardian told us about. I guess Guardian as a name, not as a title. Oh, we're just going to take all the loot. Cat, 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 cat. Cat on the sofa. Yeah, sorry, sorry. that sound at the door. It's probably nothing. I believe that a robot person is whistling. Can I not jump up there? Let's see where do I go from here. Maybe I go... Maybe I can jump up from here. Juanito says, those circles of light are pleasing to watch, but I want to watch, I want to see the real sky one day. Do you know the outside? The outside? Momo told me he'd get me there one day. Oh yes, everyone around here knows the symbol. It's the outsiders. They live on the upper floors of this area. You can probably talk to Momo about this. A music sheet? I don't play an instrument, sorry. Cat rests. How long until there's a lo-fi hip-hop? 
uh, channel that's just this. Well, at the rate that the camera is zooming out, I think that the uh, sleeping animation is going to um, naturally end at some point, but we'll see. Let's let it play. I find it amusing that my that Oreo is just sleeping over there while the cat is sleeping over here. Oh, this is zooming out farther than I thought it would. Do the robots drink beer? Like the beer bottles that are around? Or if the robots just not uh, put them away? Currently covered in cats, which is probably the way that most people playing this game would like to be. I, however, being allergic, am fine with cats this way. Okay. If you sleep, it will back up a ways. Now I know. Big stretch. Okay. And we're trying to get up to there, yes. So let's hop across here. Well, let's go see Momo and then we'll come back and see people. Hello! I am Cat. Don't mind me. Tell me how to get up. Please don't bother Vapora. She's so clumsy. Let's see, how do I get up there? So I want to get up to there because then. So I feel like this is close to where I started, right? I guess I started down there. Oh, there's a thing. Is there a bucket? Can I take a bucket there? Or do I need to transfer the bucket? Maybe jump up here. Ta-da! Looks like a person, a robot person. Looks like this person is trying to like do a, try, make a transmission. music is cool, so I'm going to leave this here for a moment while I go and use the restroom. I shall return for more cat action.
Music is still cool. Dog is flopped over there looking at me. Hello, Oreo. Yeah, that's your name. Dog stretch. All right, let's meet Momo. It's never going to work. Why did I let them go? I'm all alone now. Hey, you, what do you want? This one, right? This is a picture of the outside. Do you want to go there? Well, don't bother. It's a waste of time. It'll only bring you loneliness and despair. My friends had this dream, too. But now they're gone, and I'm all alone. I don't know where they ended up. I tried to contact them, but that... Transceiver doesn't work. Or that fucking transceiver doesn't work. My friends and I took notes of our research about the outside. Here, take mine if you really want to go out there. Momo's notebook. You're on your own. I'm done with the outside. Good luck. Momo seems very sad. He misses his friends. Let me check the notebook he gave us. The Outsider's Manifesto. We must go outside, at any cost. We must protect our brothers and sisters. We must say, stay away from the Zerks. It's signed Clementine Zbaltazar, uh, uh, Doc, and Momo. It looks like Momo's name was added later. I think we should find the other notebooks. Hey, little cat, are you still looking for those useless notebooks? Yeah, I found um, Clementine's notebook. Oh, you found Clementine's notes. She was really brave, you know. The most fearless person I've ever met. Uh, sheet music. Okay. Very well. Translate. Outsiders. What do you got? Ball! Ball! Yes. Ta <laughs> ha So when I do this, my controls are all messed up. I don't go the direction that I think I'm trying to go. Ah, that's fabulous. There's another Maneki Neko. this. The city has a cylindrical shape of about 450 meters in diameter. There is a level above ours. The city, city seems to have a ceiling, if I believe my books. A big blue sky is hidden behind. Pliers? No, we cannot do anything with pliers. Wood, so I'm just gonna leave you. I'm gonna leave you with that door. I'm just gonna come here and snoop in and around all of your stuff because I'm a cat. That's a memory. Oh, back home too. I remember this video game. It was made just after I was created, I think. I can't remember it well. The scientist and I spent a lot of time playing it. It was fun. I miss him. Why can't I remember his name? Alright. One more memory. 11% of memory is recovered. This is not a very long game, which would, honestly is great. If we can play a whole game and have a great time and, I don't know, three to six hours is according to how long to beat, then, look, well, awesome. I don't want to scratch, I want to just sleep. Okay. Where is my way out? I guess I go back out here. Loop! The symbol on this wall, uh, this symbol on the wall matches the one in the notebook. Outsiders. 
Okay, I think I already went. Uh, we already visited this place. Hey, look at that smart game. Uh, we should check out if there, see if there are other signs like that. Well, there's one over there. All right? There's one down here. Bucket. Wee! I'm a bucket again. a fan. Let's translate. Ventilation power supply, indeed. Now I can sneak in here. Bloop! Here. Yeah, <laughs> chaos. Is there a notebook in here, or is this... There's a memory down there. Can I get down there safely? Yes. Remarkable. Companions have evolved so much. In the early days, their simple AI merely imitated human art. Now this is all their own. Humans often said making art is important in desperate situations. These are certainly desperate times. So we've been there, and I guess maybe over there and over here. Maybe we, did a, we didn't get a notebook from here is the thing. Hmm. Well, let's try the other one. machine. Well, it did give us loot. Okay. Many books. like the Outsiders theme, because it turns on any time I've been in one of their apartments. Hey Doc, I found the keys to your safe. You need to be more careful with these. It's not enough to just bury your safe and behind a bunch of books. Jess, the librarian. Let's 
safe. Fridge full of books, like you do. That robot appears to be... Translation. How to develop your artificial intelligence in order to be as creative as a real human. Volume 42. Cat can also sleep here. The controller vibrates when the cat is purring. Which is great. Isn't this cool? The Great Bolt Shortage? Is that what that book said? Well, how much farther can we scroll? Can we zoom out here? There's not that much building, right? Okay. Now to find the safe, right? Oh, maybe I have to go on the other side. Take sheet music. scratch on this part. Nice work. Another notebook. This one, this one seems to belong to someone named Doc. After weeks of research, I've combined a spectrometer with a power U, powerful UV lamp. With this, we should be able to be capable of warding off Zerks on our way out. The initial attempt was explosive. I might have to test it under real conditions. Let's find the other notebooks. Okay. Do, do, do. Well, that, the, uh, the kind of outsider's music is not playing anymore. So we need one more notebook. Hello. Hepdor says, oh hey, it's you. You do look weird and small, but there's something about you. I feel to compelled to pet you, but I but won't, because I don't understand why. Energy drink? No thanks, I'm not thirsty. There's a group look of the outsiders? They were a group of people looking for the surface. Momo was one of them. One day they decided to put their plan into action and went into the sewers. Sadly, not a peep for them since. For some reason, Momo stayed behind. I think he'll always regret that decision. Poor guy. Uh, do you know music? Music sheet? I don't play an instrument, sorry. Um, 
Alright. Thanks, Scepter. I guess we do need to go back over there and look for something. Because we have. We need one more notebook. Says, careful, I need to focus. I don't want to drop another bucket. Okay. Spring. a notebook somewhere? I must have. Outsiders? Like chaos. I'm not sure what cat thing I just did. Cat a bolt. seems to belong to someone named Zabaltar, Baltazar. All trace of organic life has disappeared except for what we call the Zerks. They seem to heal almost anything that moves and breed at an inconceivable rate, as if being locked into this city wasn't hard enough. Oh, there's also a note in this book. It says, I found a design flaw in the transceiver, but I think I figured out how to fix it. Here's the equation. With this, we should be able to help Momo repair the transceiver. If it can communicate with the upper levels, that could be our way up. Let him show me. Let's show him what we found. Nice. Here we go. Time has come. Oh, translate. Earth. Earth is the third planet from the sun and fifth largest in the solar system by mass and diameter. To date, it is the only celestial object known to foster life. According to radiometric dating, the Earth is 4.54 billion years old. It has a single natural satellite, the moon, which formed soon after. The gravitational interaction with the moon creates the tides, stabilizes the Earth's axis of rotation, and gradually reduces its rotation speed. Hello. Yes, I found the notebooks. 
Oh, mm-hmm. it belonged to Doc. It was really a, oh, a huge nerve for electronics and stuff. He was always on the verge of a great discovery. Wait, you actually found all my friend's notebooks? Oh, what's that note? The transceiver can be repaired? <gasps> this is incredible! That means we should be able to communicate outside of the slums! Clementine, this is Baltazar. Doc, I'm sorry I doubted our case. Our cause. I'll promise you. I will find a way to reach the surface. Thank you. We might be able to find a way up. Now let's fix this junk piece of junk transceiver. Montage. Et voila! It works. Checking texts in case something important came in. Because texting is how my uh, uh, computer repair place is getting in touch with me. But it was not them. Come with me. Up there, see that building high, ab- high above the others? If you install the transceiver at the very top of the tower, we should be able to communicate with the whole city. My friends still might be out there. If there is a way out, they'll know it. Okay. You're the only one small and quick enough to evade the Zerks. We need you, little outsider. Bring us to the sky. Alright, so we're going there. I suppose I could go back down and talk to all the people, since I went to see Momo first. Rooftops. Ooh, look at that. Creepy. Okay, so maybe I can't go back and talk to the people now. I don't know that there's a way back. Yeah. All right. I guess for only forward. Sharpening my claws. Meow to attract enemies. simple evasion puzzles to begin with. By way of uh, tutorializing dealing with the Zerks, I guess. That's a memory. Looks like the word Jedi. (laughs) 
The city is full of neon. It wasn't always this way. There used to be strict energy caps, especially in the slums. But people couldn't handle the constant darkness. One day, someone lit up rainbow lamps, neon signs all over their house. That person was taken away and never seen again. But people saw hope, and not long after, everyone started putting lots of lights in their homes. There was nothing the oppressors could do. It was a fun way for people to see colors again, like on the outside. I think it helped. Do these unlock in order? Have I already missed, like, seven? Well, I suppose it's a short game. I can go back through if I really need to. Yeah, so these are the Zerks. They appear to be like uh, pink slime monsters. Like uh, the Greg Bear novel with the pink slime. So there's the pink slime here, but not the Zerks, it looks like. Can I get in? Aha! Uh -huh. Thunk! Time to cat. feel great about this. Something, something only. I need to go now. I'll just avoid you. 
No, I don't think I can. So you're on the other side. And so what, I need to let you in here and then I'm probably going to need to get that barrel, is my thought. Oh no! go like make a circuit to get the barrel. Here. Oh, there's a memory. Let's go ahead and get that memory. Nico Corp. They were responsible for waste management. Oh, so they're the ones that made this. As trash from the upper levels overloaded the slums, they tried to de develop a bacteria to dissolve it all. After the humans disappeared, the bacteria mutated. Growing, eating way more than trash. And now we have the Zerks. Let's go. Well, maybe I did miss seven of these already. Oh, I think I need to get in there and then. Uh, and then I need to get up to this, probably. You're important. The question is, where do I take you? game seems to be, or at least so far, if there is something that seems like the obvious solution to the puzzle, it is. something. Hello. What are you? Okay. Uh-oh.
Well, that seemed to work. They just want to come with me and eat my face. Oh, jeez. This is quite loud. Alright, up the tower. Transceiver. Use item. I have done it. Is there a convenient bucket that will take me back down to the robot uh, town? Look, the view. It's beautiful from here. I remember now, the city. It was meant to be a shelter. Those look like stars, but they're only lights marking the hermetic roof sealing off the city. Humankind built this shell to protect themselves from the outside. But it came at a cost. Nobody can get out. The outside was a disaster. Completely barren, unlivable, and dangerous. But if you must, if you come from there, it must mean it's safe again. And my promise wasn't just to go to the outside. It was to open the city. I still don't understand why some memories are coming back and others aren't. But I'm certain now this is my purpose. I have to open the city. Come on, let's go back and find Momo. Now that we've connected the transmitter, we should be able to get help. Okay, so these are like core memories. Whee! Yep, it's the whole level that we just went by. It's nice that it takes us back to Momo. Uh oh. Look, a note! A little outsider, if you're reading this, that means you're still alive. Excellent! I took some equipment to the bar to take advantage of their antenna. Come meet me there! I've locked the window, but the code to open is quite simple. It is... <laughs> okay. Be careful, it is case sensitive. See, you have to bar. Th that must be the code for the window near the entrance. Let's go. Here's the lock for the window. The code was... Hmm, I think it was an H, I think. Oops, my bad. Let's try that again. And it was O, or was it... Um, let me see. Okay. Oh, was at the bar waiting for us. Thank you, B12. I'm glad the game did not ask me to try to remember 17 zillion... Uh... Is that the bar over there? Let's find out. Oh, 
this has an antenna. Go talk to the the other robots if not if nothing else. Hello. Guap, you want something? I've heard that Barter Man is looking for stuff like that. Do you have music? Um all right. Hello. Grandma made me these clothes. Pretty stylish, no? Do you know an instrument? Okay. Grandma clothing. I got to, uh, thunk. I do love knitting. So far I've never knitted 478 miles of scarves. It's something to do. If you bring me some electric cable, I can make you a poncho. You inspire me, but it's not easy to find the right materials around here. Sheet music? I will find somebody who does who plays music at some point, I have to imagine. Translate. Barter Man, Super Spirit Laundry, Grandma Clothing, Elliot Programming. Is this bar for Barter Man? Hey, little furball! Come here, I managed to get a signal. I want to jump on the on the stool. Yes! Let me see if I can get this thing working. I've almost got it. Hello, can anyone hear me? Hello, yes we can hear you. We are from the slums. We're looking for a way out and... Wait, is that you, Zabaltazar? Momo? I can't believe it! I'm so happy to hear your voice, Zubaltazar! Where are you? Are the others okay? Yes, we are safe. We found a way up. Hello? Do you still hear me? You have to go through the sewers to reach us. Very dangerous. Zerks everywhere. Sewers! How? Oh, hello? Damn it, we lost the signal. I can't believe it! Zubaltazar is alive! He and the other outsiders managed to go up through the sewers? The sewers the most dangerous place in the slums, but if Zabaltazar made it, there must be a way. Alright. So how are we going to make it through the sewers? Seamus. You'll never get past the sewers. It's infested with Zerks. They'll make a quick, quick meal out of you. Especially you, little one. Many tried their luck in the past. It doesn't end well. Anyway, I warned you. Your business is none of my business. There's a Meg. Famous. His father, Doc, used to be a great scientist. He was working on some new weapon to fight the Zerks. A few years ago, he went off to test the device and never came back. Seamus has never been the same since. So the camera extends to about here. So if you sit there, you should be off camera. Don't listen to Seamus. He's just scared like I was. If Doc built a weapon, that's our ticket to join the Outsiders. In his notebook, Doc mentioned a secret lab a few times. That must be where he was working on it. There might be a clue in Seamus' apartment. Come on, follow me. 
Do we have permission to be there? I don't know. All right, what cat chaos can I cause here? Um, cat. Hello. Jacob, you're new around here. What can I do for you? Music? Nope, no music. All right. R. Oop, translate thing. One, two, eight, three. Is it code to something? Jukebox. Is this music from the game? Cat dances! Billy, you want something? Jacob, Employee of the Month, September XX27. Emory? Do they really consume this? The original design didn't have a digestive system. Maybe they somehow evolved by mimicking humans. Do you think I should try some of it? I do not want to be disrespectful of their ways. Okay. Getting there. Cat plays billiards. Cat plays pool. Alright, so. Alright, do I get points if I knock this in the in there? sheet music. Hello. Carl. This is the newspaper from the people living above on level two. It's a few years old, but it's something to read. Do you know music? That's everything then. Jump, 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 jump. Alright. Where is Barterman? Barterman. Spirit laundry. Zack. I left in the streets the next day. The Zerks have consumed it completely. They can eat anything, everything. All the weird stuff happens to you, Meg. I don't dare leave our village. It's too dangerous. Besides, the Guardian is the only one who can open this door. Worship me. Worship me! Worship me more! Alright. You also will worship me.
This Papa made a Zerg fighting weapon. This could be our way to the next level. We need to fo uh, follow him. Yeah, but follow where? Oh, are you Barter Man? You have things. Now this is Galaxy. Look at all the great stuff that falls into our trash. So many treasures. We should go visit the Barter Man. There's something for everyone over there. Do you music? Nope. Okay. Hello. Roshi, I take care of the plants. The human improve, improved them so much. Now they require very little light. I just add a bit of water and look how big they get. This is really an amazing technology. I will find the music robot somewhere. Are they all meditating? Hello. Angela. Oh, I go up there. There's nothing there. You really think you'd take the elevator? I've never seen that thing work, and I'd be 374 years old tomorrow. You gave us such a fright. We thought you were a Zerk. The ancient stories speak of a natural light that leaked from a star and landed at our feet. The light caused warmth and well-being in our ancestors. It helped them to grow. Our long-gone ancestors, the soft ones, left of the city. Our home is their legacy. Only our ancestors can distinguish this color. It is said they once dominated the world. Hello. You look lost. What do you need? Do you play music? Can you tell me where Barter Man is? Okay. Are you the barter? You look like a barter person. Hello, I'm the merchant of the market. Can you give me something? I'll give you something in exchange. It's as simple as that. This is a set of electric cable, the best on the market. So this is what I can get to get a poncho. I'll exchange this for a super spirit detergent. It's the best I can do. Okay. This is an ancient relic, a testament to the talent of our ancestors. It will cost you three energy drink cans. I can't do less. This is a music sheet, a masterful piece of art by a very renowned artist. It will cost you one energy drink can. I can't do less. Okay. And then you're just a thing to, sit, to stand on. Hello! Chaos. More chaos. Hello. Leto, we're fortunate to have these items to help us defend against the Zerks. The slum has its threats, and preparation is key. Someone must play an instrument. Look at all the hidden gems in this penny, in this trash. Pennies from heaven, or from somewhere, anyway. I will find the musical robot. Alright, so I need laundry detergent. Or several more cans. Let's see, did I, did I find a laundry? Was there a laundry somewhere? Oh, there is a sign for the laundry, right? Super Spirit Laundry? Let me get 
there, and there, and there. Jump up here. This, and one of these. somewhere. No, I don't think you are the laundromat. Ready? This bed is mine now. So these robots had some way of making pictures, whether that was they painted them or some kind of printing anything. the longer map. I saw someone in the stream get there, so I know it exists. Well, I'm going to look around for the longer map a bit, and then if I can't find it, I will probably stop for the day, and then I will look up where the longer map is, so that I don't have to spend too much time turn the TV on. Cat TV. This is the library. Oh, hey! Where's the... not see the activity thing because it was only on my computer and not on the stream. So thank you to uh, Learn Ward, Learn Ward and CNR, or CR. Uh, I'll, if you want to let me know how to pronounce that, then that is great. Thank you so much for the follow, and that means that we are at 90 followers, which is the follower goal. And that means that if you are watching right now and you do not already have uh, Lauren Ward answer, great, thank you. Um, in addition to <laughs> um, streaming video games, uh, the main thing that I do is that I'm a writer. So if you do not already have a copy of my book, Geekomancy, I will give away one copy of that book in ebook format, so that's EPUB or Mobi, to anybody who is watching. It, um, all you have to do is just type in the word geekomancy into the chat, and I'll leave it open for a couple minutes uh, in case other people are around and would like to enter. Uh, thank you to whoever activated that geekomancy command. Thank you to the kids who are asleep to let anyone who is watching who doesn't already know about the series know what uh, those books are about. And I'm just going to make chat a little bigger. Can I do that? Yes, I just want a little bit more chat so I can see. Alright. Are you the laundry? It 
it's fun to just run around as a cat, honestly. Ah, so there's the laundromat. Let me in! Are you one of the troublemakers playing with the paint buckets on the roof? Keep your paint away. I'm tired tired of cleaning my stoop because of your mess. Well, here's the thing. Windows. <laughs> Windows exist. And now that I know that this is here, I'm coming for you. For your laundry detergent. Um, so yeah, if you're just joining us, we met our follower goal that I set a little while ago. And therefore, if you uh, do not already have a copy of my book, Geekomancy, just type the word Geekomancy into the chat. You'll be entered to win um, an ebook. I'm going to see if I can knock this off the wall. Ha 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 ha, chaos. How do I get inside? Alright, so I can. Nope, uh, that's not where it's going. Meow. Watch cat. How do I get inside? I feel like it will be a window somewhere. Ah, I got a copy a couple days ago. Well, thank you for getting a copy a couple days ago, though. Uh, it makes uh, getting a, cop a copy now less, uh, uh, less of a thing. Um, if you already have a copy, and you have a friend who you think would enjoy uh, reading it, you can also enter to uh, like on their behalf, and I can send it to you to send to them, or send it to them directly. That's not a way in. It's a sink. All right. So if anybody else would like to enter to win that copy of Geekomancy, we've got another minute or so. Otherwise, I will uh, pick from the folks who have already done so. Because if I could get into there, then maybe that's something. But I can't jump on those. Um, ah, come on, Seamus, open the door. You know your father would have wanted to help us. Well, that was to be expected. This situation is pretty tough on, on Seamus. Alright, let's get some people can see. There we go. He doesn't want to hear about the outsiders anymore. He won't help me. But you... I think I have an idea. Maybe I have to do this part before I can do the detergent. Aha! Uh -huh. Here, take Doc's notebook and show it to Seamus. It contains a lot of information that will hopefully act as an electroshock. Find the secret lab, little outsider. I'm going back to the bar to try to reestablish communication with the others. Here we go. First, an app. Seamus. What are you doing in here? I told you, getting through the sewers is a suicide mission. Leave me be. Well, what if I give you... This. Wait, what's this? Is this my papa's? Oh wow, I never knew. There's a secret room here in our flat? But where? Probably not that. Um, secret room. Must cat. Aha! 
one I don't think is in front of anything. No. <laughs> Use digit code. Um, so I think it was one, two, eighty-three. Hmm. Okay. Uh, so you can, it's a, uh, it's the clocks on the wall. Two five one one. Nice. All right, last call for entrances in the giveaway. If you have not already done so type the word geek commencing into the chat um, and then I will pick a winner. I've never less never seen this room. I can't believe you managed to hide it from me all this time. These footprints, they must be for his zerk weapon. Papa was always so secretive with his work. He told me the weapon was working in theory, but it needed a real life test. He went outside the slums and he never came back. Well, is the prototype here or did the doc take it? Robot news headlines. Zerks are officially no longer under control. Now they, they now they eat metal. That seems not great. Find anything interesting in here? Okay. Deflexor. Concept, light-based handgun. Low priority, visual appearance, size, decibel emitted. High priority, test in real condition. Objective, 20 Zerk destroyed per second. Cat Chaos. Is there a thing in here? No. Well, this looks like, no, that's a Zerk. Cute sounds, but never friendly. Old bacteria of human time. Eat all kinds of materials. Total vision in the dark. React to intense light! Alright, uh, so Lauren Moore Dancer, uh, you are the winner of the um, giveaway. So if, you, uh, if you're going to pass this on to a friend, you can either, um, if you know that your friend wouldn't mind getting emailed, or if you would like to pass it on to themselves, you can just uh, send me a whisper here on Twitch uh, with the address I should send the, the book to. Probably send to you, or if you want to check with a friend and send it on to them, then let me know. Um, one way or the other, just let me know where I should send it, and um, I will do that thing. Thank you everybody for following and helping me grow the channel, which is a fun thing that I do to uh, talk to the world without having to be in the world. So that's that. Where do I go? What else do I need to do in here? Do I need to knock the circuit thing off? Because that's this thing. Can I jump up there? No. Well, here's a picture. Okay, light. So what do you think? Well, that doesn't seem to be anything yet. Turns out we need to jump up there. Is there another box to knock over? No. Up here. Aha! Ta-da! I 
found it. Okay. Seamus. I did. Here's the thing. Wait, I remember that. That's his tracker. Papa always used that tracker to keep an eye on where I was. Maybe we can reverse it to find out where he went. I can't believe my Papa might still be alive. I missed him so much. You need a weapon to fight the Zerks, right? My, def my Papa definitely took one with him. We just need to prepare the tracker so we can find him. Someone in the slums should be able to help. Come with me. I'll open the door for you. The thing that the strain needs uh, humanoids for. Opening doors. Do you have detergent? No. Oh, there's a memory. Rip to humans. Humans were the first residents around here. Seems they're all dead now. What do you think it feels like being dead? I know it's silly coming for me, but are they actually at peace? Will I be at peace when I die? I don't know what death feels like for an AI. I'm sorry, I didn't want to break the mood. Let's move on. Alright, so we are filling in these uh, gaps. Drink. So that's what energy drink too. Yep. Oh, okay. I think that is all three that I needed to get the um, wire. Because they're over here. Who can play music? I'm hoping. Yes, I have so many musics for you. Cool down. I think I can play this. Look. going to zone out with this for a bit and then I'm going to call it for the day. I see that I have the whisper, so thank you for that. I'll get in touch shortly. to um, streaming and writing. I write about publishing and co-host a actual play show called Speculate. But in a moment, I think I'm going to have to co-host the dog's walk through the neighborhood. So that is going to be that for us today. Thank you so much to Lauren Wardancer for the follow uh, and for entering the giveaway. Thanks to the Kids Are Asleep and Trivity Mats and everybody else who came by to hang out. Hang out. My computer is still in the shop, so if I stream this Sunday, it may just be another stream of Stray because I don't know that I'll be able to effectively do like a world building stream from this laptop here that maybe does not have the power to do all the things that I want. Plus it just doesn't have that much screen space. So that is going to be that. And now I will end broadcast.
Bye.